एवरी वन वेलकम टू एनदर न्यू वीडियो सो एज सुन एज यू वेक अप मेक अ हैबिट ऑफ क्रिएटिंग अ चेक लिस्ट ऑफ टास्क विच यू हैव टू अकम्पलिश इन अर डे बिकॉज दैट विल ऑर्गेनाइज ऑल द थिंग्स यू हैव टू डू एंड विल इवन मोटिवेट यू टू फिनिश वन आफ्टर द अदर सो बिफोर स्टार्टिंग विद सच अ बिजी एंड हेक्टिक डे इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू एनर्जाइज आज सो फॉर एनर्जी वी मस्ट हैव आर ब्रेकफस्ट टू आर टमी फुल सो मेक श्योर टू हैव हेल्दी एज वेल एज टेस्टी ब्रेकफस्ट सो फॉर टूडे आई एम having paneer sandwiches and this is the stuffing which we are going to put in between two bread slices and roast it on the pan so this was one of my favorite breakfast and it will be forever until i try something new and find that wow this is more better than that one fine so i had it and then started with a new chapter human eye and the colorful world actually i have started it the before day but was unable to take video clips and many of you guys have completed this chapter and i was like wow my friends have completed this chapter before so why don't we start and check out how this chapter looks like easy or difficult according to me as i have completed half of this chapter it's very interesting only if you concentrate so concentrate well you will find it interesting and if you are not going to concentrate and first only before starting if you feel that are yaar ye bahut hi mushkil lag rahi hai then obviously you will feel sleepy boring and you will never finish up this chapter yaar defects in vision it's very simple you just need to remember those names. perfectly because they will ask you guys that in which human eye defect a person can see distant objects properly but cannot see the near objects or clearly and the answer is hypermetropia that is far sightedness so you must remember the name and yes guys it's very challenging to study during vacation especially during festive season it's very very difficult but then also we must understand the consequences if we don't finish off our work this time suppose we have to complete our record book that the stuff and if we won't complete that what will be the consequence you will be punished you will be guilty of it and you will be ashamed in front of your friends and human eye and the colorful world if you are not going to start this chapter before your mam starts it will be difficult to cover when your mam starts it so you must be uh, you know aware of the consequences and obviously then you will complete all your tasks on time and yes don't forget to reward yourself after you finish off a task because if you reward yourself for every task you completed you will find more motivation in yourself to do further tasks with great enthusiasm so here my dad was going out for some work and i was like dad i will also come because i want to feel the nature for some time i want to take fresh air so i went and came back after half an hour i guess yeah half an hour or 45 minutes and then i started with the science record book yaar finished karni hai itne sare experiments so these are all the experiments which we have to finish it off are yaar mujhe ye samajh nahi aata see the school people will say us to complete our record book and bring it but will they show us the experiment in the lab will they take us to lab and show that that is my question so let's see if they will do that and it's not an easy task to complete our record book yaar bahut time lagti hai it is so so difficult uh, when i started it i thought are yaar ho jayega masti maza hi hai nahi nahi hai bahut hi zyada प्रेजर है हमारे बच्चों के एनी वेस एट एनी कॉस्ट वी मस्ट फिनिश ऑफ आर रिकॉर्ड और लैब मैन्यूल बिकॉज इफ यू डोंट द कॉन्सिक्वेंसेज इन फ्रंट ऑफ अर्स आर वेरी बैड बिकॉज दी फर्स्ट डे ऑफ स्कूल आफ्टर दसरा वेकेशन इट्स गोना बी वेरी वर्स्ट डे फर्स्ट डे है पर फिर भी वर्स्ट डे ही होगा इफ यू डोंट फिनिश योर हॉलडे होमवर्क सो मेक श्योर टू लुक इन टू योर हॉलडे होमवर्क वन सेकेंड वॉट ऑल आर गिवन एंड मेक श्योर दैट यू हैव कवर्ड एवरी थिंग एंड इफ नॉट फिनिश इट ऑफ बाई the first day after the summer vacation and it's time to reward ourselves right i'll be preparing paneer fried rice so this is going to be our evening snack for today and i thought let's try it because this is one of my trending recipe so let's do that but before that we have to dip paneer in water like this actually i decided to do all paneer based recipes today morning i said my mom to do paneer sandwiches and she did this and for evening snacks and for dinner also we are going to make paneer based only so now i'm making paneer fried rice this is the first time i'm trying so i don't know how this comes out to be but i hope that it goes well so here goes paneer now let's fry it because my mom thought to teach me some cooking lessons during this vacation time because cooking is also important because we don't know what 
may come what if whatever the situation is you must know cooking right isn't that so you are teenager now you must start learning cooking from right now right so fry it in oil well until it reaches a light brown color and sprinkle a little amount of red chili powder as well as salt over it and then take it away into a separate plate and yeah our fried paneer is ready now let's add some oil in the same kadai actually we have to use another one but uh, to reduce my work so i have used the same one and here i am adding jeera as well as mustard as spices and then let's add an onion completely chopped onion and then few curry leaves and uh, let's just mix it well and then add chopped chilies and that's based on you how much spicy you want to make you can add those many and yeah mix it mix it very well so that they get fried up properly and get a brown light brown color yeah so once it is done just uh, yeah take a snap and then add a rice because we are making paneer fried rice right so rice is main important mix it very well but before that add some chili powder as well as uh, salt add some amount of jeera powder as well as coriander powder and then mix it very well and make sure to take a snap and as well as a video while cooking so as to do show off in oh, front no. of your friends and family members and then finally after mixing add those fried paneer pieces as toppings in the rice and then what you have to do is mix gently and add some coriander also actually i hate coriander but as my mom said i have to add it and now here my brother has come and is taking some thumbnail photos but actually i have just added one photo from this in one corner and yeah finally it's time to serve it but mai serve karne wali hu meri style and according to me i think serving is more important than cooking because if we serve it very well obviously the heaters are going to attract to it and eat it as much as they want and here is my dome shaped rice and here already inside this rice are a lot of paneer pieces just to give it a proper look i have just added two or three pieces of paneer as toppings because i have to even take a photo yeah everyone our paneer rice is ready now i'll taste it and say you guys how it is but it is first photo time photos are more important than tasting right as a youtuber photos are more important than tasting so for thumbnail it is very very important as well as the food vloggers also it is very very important now i will test the taste of the recipe and tell you whether to try or not and yes the recipe went really amazing you must try it now it's time to study again so guys just as i have a defect in vision because i'm having myopia and i'm even having a defect in drawing diagrams so what i have did is just a messy diagram so i have covered it in like this and just writing all the vision defects that's it now i'm writing the difference between myopia and hypermetropia so me and my mom both are having myopia but my dad is having presbyopia until my dad reached 45 years he hasn't got spectacles yet but after 45 years due to old age hypermetropia which is caused due to aging he has got spectacles and that vision defect is called as presbyopia and my grandpa is also having presbyopia Here I have started a new concept called prism and dispersion of light and guys the next concept will be electromagnetic spectrum so I have an amazing trick to remember all the electromagnetic waves so yeah so guys bartano ko use karte hai vim aur isko rim bana do body ko use karte hai lux isko wax bana do ye dono hai bahut hi mast aur isko hum good bana do rim wax good to aap hi bana do full form iska rim wax good chalo bana do So R is radio waves, I is infrared waves, M is microwaves, V is visible light, U is UV rays, and X is X rays. And here in good you have to only care about G. G is nothing but gamma rays. That's it. Khatam. So guys, the best way to understand science is to link it with your present environment as well as nature because that is gonna help you to score good grades in science. And I have experienced it in my real life. So guys, maybe my trick is silly, but it had made the concept easy. So I hope you all loved that. And uh, I just wanted to share it with my subscribers and viewers because they would also love that. So okay, then I'll meet you all with another new video. Bye.